And welcome back, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, damas y caballeros, caballeros, as we turn to page 62 of our, uh, what was it, last page 61? Yeah, page 62 of our problem set. We're going to take a look at this, see what we got going here. Use a tape diagram to model each problem. Solve using a simplifying strategy or an algorithm, and write... Your answer is a statement. Okay, let's take a look at our very first one. It says the length of Carter's driveway is, uh, let's zoom in here so we can actually see this, 12 meters, 38 centimeters. I'm going to circle that right there. Uh, his neighbor's driveway is 4 meters, 99 centimeters longer. How long is his neighbor's driveway? Oh, my goodness. First thing we're going to do is you use the tip diagram. So uh, Carter's driveway is, and we're copycats, 12 meters, 38 centimeters. All right, the neighbor's driveway, who's he's so envious of his neighbor's driveway, is 4 meters, 99 centimeters longer. So let's go ahead and add these up, okay? So use a simplifying strategy. You know, okay, let's use it. Let's add them. Let's do this one right here. Let's see, 12 meters plus 4 meters. And we'll do 38 centimeters plus 99 centimeters. I think this will be a good way to, I'm going to put the larger number on top because it's a strategy. Okay, beep, the M drops down. You with me? Two plus four is six, bring down the one, 16 meters. Okay, now we gotta add the centimeters. Well, nine plus eight is 17. That's our 10, that's our seven. Whoops, forgot the centimeters. And then we do nine plus one is 10 plus, ooh, 130 centimeters. Well, how many meters are in 130 centimeters? Well, let's make bond. My name is Bond, a number Bond. Not really a number Bond, but we know there's 100 centimeters in a meter, so I'm going to put one meter here and 37 meters here. Well, look, now all we have to do is add the meters, and we got, we got the centimeters. Oops, sorry, centimeters there. So you have one meter plus 16, that's 17 meters, and we have 37 centimeters left over. So the neighbor's driveway is... 17 meters, 37 centimeters, and I'm not going to have us write a sentence because there's not enough room here to do that. Okay, uh, Enya walked two kilometers, 309 meters. Well, that's quite a walk. From school to the store. Then she walked from the store to her house. If she walked a total of five kilometers, how far was it from the store to her home? Hmm. All right, this is quite a problem. So she starts off walking two kilometers, 309 meters to get to the store. Then she walks another five kilometers to get from her uh, to her house. So time for the tape diagram. I'll make a nice, um, there we go. So the first part of her trip is what? Two kilometers, 309 meters. Two kilometers, 309 meters. All right. The total amount she walked, if she walked a total of five kilometers, and this is what represents the total. Confusing, no? Yes. She, she walked a total of five kilometers, and part of that five kilometers was the two kilometers, 309 meters that she walked from school to the store. So now we have to do some subtraction. What simplifying strategy should we use? Let's just turn this into 5,000 meters. And we'll just subtract this. That'll be 2,309. I like that simplifying strategy. Thank you, Math Matt. And here we go. Time to do a little decomposing. And what we're going to do is this will become 4,000. This will become Ten hundreds are one thousand. We'll decompose it to nine hundreds, and oh, we still need to do a little more decomposing. This will be 
10 tens or 100. We'll decompose that. It'll become 9 tens, and then this will become 10 ones. So let's bring down our meters. 10 minus 9. 10 meters minus 9 meters is 1 meter. 9 minus 0 is 9. 9 minus 3 is 6. And 4,000 minus 2,000 is 2,000. So 2,691 meters. However, we need to write this in kilometers because that's a lot of meters, right? So how many kilometers would be in here? Well, if you said 2 kilometers and 691 meters, you'd be absolutely correct. And that's the amount that goes here. 2 kilometers, 691 meters. Add those together, we get 5 kilometers. It's true. We'll continue on. Richelle has 5 meters, 32 centimeters, has rope that's that long, uh, that she cut into two pieces. Okay. One piece is 249 centimeters long. How many centimeters long is the other piece of rope? Oh, come on, Eureka. Boy, so let's start with the first piece of rope. She bought it. Or she had the rope. I don't know if she bought it. But it was 5 meters, 32 centimeters. Okay. So she cut it into two pieces, and one piece was 249 centimeters long. The simplifying strategy I'm going to use here is I'm just going to convert this to centimeters. Okay, so 500 meter, 500 centimeters and five meters would so be 532 centimeters minus 249 centimeters. And you can go and pause, and you do the math. Welcome back. Okay, I can't subtract 9 centimeters from 2 centimeters, so I'm going to decompose. And this will become a total of 12 centimeters, because I grabbed 10 centimeters from there. Bring down the unit of measure. 12 minus 9 is 3. I cannot take 40 centimeters away from 20 centimeters, so I'm going to take 10 pens from over here. Now I have 120 centimeters minus 4 centimeters would be 80. Then 400 minus 200 is 200. I have 283 centimeters. That's what this side represents. That's a lot of centimeters. Let's see if we can convert that to meters. There's 100 centimeters in um, a meter, so we have 2 meters, 83 centimeters. Do you want to do one more? I say we do want to do one more. I say that. Okay, Jason rode his bike 529 fewer meters than Allison. Why? I don't know. Jason rode one kilometer, 850 meters. Hmm. How many meters did Allison ride? Okay, so this is what Jason rode. It's a total of one kilometer. Tape diagram time. One kilometer, 850 meters. Is that right? So one click, that's what they call them in the military. One kilometer, 850 meters. Okay, there's 529 fewer meters than Allison. Okay, so Allison went up 529 meters farther. All we got to do is add. And the way I'm going to add is I'm going to add the meters first. Simplifying strategy. I think you'll see why. I hope you'll see why. Okay, zero plus nine. 9, 5 plus 2, 7, 8 plus 5 is 13. So look, now I can say, okay, I get it, I get it. There's a 1,000 meters in a kilometer, right? So now this becomes 1 kilometer, 379 meters. And look, all we got to do, because I've added this and I've added that, all we got to do is add the kilometer up. Mm, so that becomes 2 kilometers, 379 meters. And that is how far Allison rode her bike. So she rode it uh, two kilometers, 379 meters. And that was my simplifying strategy. Hope you enjoyed that lesson. I know I did. We'll see you back at the student debrief. Maybe we'll have a special guest for you. And Mr. Lake continues to figure out Screencastify. I hope I recorded this lesson because I worked really hard on it. I did.